Hi, Shell Point. I'm here with Liz from Lee Health. She's the breast cancer nurse navigator, and we're talking about a program we want you to know about in Wellness Connection. It's occurring on October 8th, but first, let's welcome Liz. Thank you for being here this morning. Thank you for having me. Can you share with our residents what your role is with Lee Health? So I'm a breast cancer nurse navigator, and I meet patients at any time in their continuum of care. It can be from newly diagnosed, just getting an education piece in there, and I also meet with patients who have financial needs, unable to afford screenings and diagnostics, so mammograms, biopsies. And uh, we also have a multidisciplinary breast clinic for newly diagnosed breast cancer patients, both male and female. And that happens on a Friday morning. And I meet with them, kind of coordinate their care, and follow them through. Okay, Thank journey. you. Thank you, and October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. You'll be here on October 8th in the Grand Cypress Room at 11 a.m. for a presentation. Share about that presentation. What should we know? Okay, so breast cancer awareness is really important. I mean, getting diagnosed, mm -hmm. if you have to, at an earlier stage definitely has better outcomes. So screening guidelines. I want to go over self-breast awareness, what men and women should look for in a breast cancer diagnosis. Also the screening guidelines, how often should you be having mammograms? What's the follow up after a mammogram if something shows up? Also the different types of breast cancer, what some of those treatment options are, and a lot about survivorship and surveillance too. Mm -hmm. So patients have a previous best breast cancer diagnosis mm -hmm. and they want to know what happens next what should be happening, mm -hmm. what should they be looking for. So it's going to be a comprehensive package. Uh, sounds like it. <laughs> um, a lot of education, and I want to hone in on something you said, men and women. Uh, I think many people think that this is just something that women go through, but oh, no, tell certainly. us about that. So one in eight women are definitely going to be diagnosed with breast cancer in their lifetimes in the U.S., and one in a thousand men are also going to be diagnosed with breast cancer. Strong family history, mm -hmm. uh, the breast cancer gene, breast cancer BRCA1 and 2 also plays a role for men in breast cancer. And sometimes it's sporadic, it just happens as well. So we've seen quite a few, not quite a few, but definitely a few men, male breast cancer patients as well. Yeah, absolutely. And I think most of us have known at least one person that has gone through this. Exactly. So you'll be here this month to really spread that awareness and educate us about this disease. So I look forward to it. Very excited about yeah, being Yeah, we are too. So this is the first time you'll be at Shell Point, and we're yes. happy to have you. <laughs> Thank you so Thanks much. Thanks again for being here. If you're interested in attending the Breast Cancer Awareness Program on October 8th, please sign up at the concierge desk. This is going to be something uh, very important that you won't want to miss out on. Thank you. Stay well.